Hi everyone and welcome to the day 3 of our challenge. Today we will focus on a pelvic floor and core strengthening. So it's like we are building the muscles from inside to be ready for more advanced workouts. If you still are not subscribed to this channel, please do so so you don't miss any other workouts. And that's it, just grab yourself a bottle of water and let's get started. Okay, we start with activating all the muscles that we have in the lower part of the belly, the pelvic floor. So with the exhale, just be sure to lift up your knees and go direction to your chest. Inhale, are down, exhale, close to your chest. Be sure your spine is on the floor, not lift it up. You can put for this reason hands under your glutes just to support your spine. And keep on doing, keep on breathing. Okay, keep your feet now on the floor. Hands next to the feet with the exhale, lift up your hips, contract your glutes, your abdominals. Inhale down, exhale up. Every time you go with the spine to the crown and lift it up so we are not arching the back but tuck your belly inside. Keep this area strong, your core, your glutes contracted. Now we do the same, but we just add one more movement. So we go up, pulse, back, down. With the exhale, go up and open, inhale down. Now let's go up again in your glute bridge. This time you stay up with your hips and hold. Squeeze your glutes together as much as you can. Contract this part, your core and stay. Now we go down with the glutes, up with the legs 90 degrees, up with the shoulders and with the arms. We just go up and down, whole arms, keep on breathing, contract your abdominals. Now you can keep your hands again under your glutes and we just straight the legs, point your feet, open a bit and again, bend, stretch, open, bend, stretch, open, shoulders are up.
Now keep your legs bended and with exhale just open them to the sides. You can keep your hands under your head or if it's too much, just keep it down. Now let's go up on your elbows, straight your spine with the exhale, just tap with your toes one by one. Return back and tap. Okay, we go back for our glute bridge. This time, you stretch your right leg just as much as you can, and with the exhale, lift up your hips. Squeeze when you're up. Down with the right foot, lift up your left. And let's do the same with the exhale, lift up, squeeze, inhale down. Now let's go down with the feet, we go for a round two. So again with the knees, with the exhale, we just go close to the chest and then inhale, feet down on the ground. If you feel it more, you can always go up with your shoulders. Let's go back for the glute bridge. So exhale up, squeeze and squeeze, inhale down. We did already more than a half. It's gonna be much easier for you now. So just keep on going. You're doing a great job. Now we go up again, exhale, open, close and down. Now be sure when you're opening the knees, your hips are all the way up. So nothing between, don't arch your back. Just go up, squeeze, open and down.
Now let's go up with your hips. Just squeeze your glutes together as much as you can. Contract here and just hold. Really try to do it as strong as possible. Keep on breathing, slow breaths in and out through the mouth. Let's go down with the spine, legs up 90 degrees, shoulders up with the arms up and down. We're almost finishing, so just keep on going, contract your abs here. Look at your knees, more or less, don't look up, otherwise you will have pain. The movement is going through the shoulders, so not just with the hands, strong arms and hold. Breathe slowly. Now you can stay with your heads up or go down and we go with the legs open, bend, straight, open. When you do this, exhale and try to like suck your belly in. So inhale, blow, exhale, suck and contract. Point your feet. Now keep your legs bended with the exhale, just open to the side. Not too much, control the movement. Now let's go for the last step on the elbow, straight your spine, tap with your toes with the exhale on the floor. Try not just to drop it down, but tap in front and return. Remember, you can always go down if it's too difficult, it's fine, okay? Just listen to your body and choose your own level. Good. Now let's stay down. Let's just stretch a bit your hips, your back, your belly. So now just keep your spine down on the mat. The exhale, just open your knees to the side. Let the gravity stretch the hips for you. And breathe for five, four, thirty, two, One, and just open your arms to the side, knees together, and we go with the knees to the right side, head to the left. Three, four, five. Four. Thirty. Two. 
to one. And we change knees to the left, head to the right. And we hold for five. Four. Thirty. Two. And one. Back up with the knees. Just keep your spine on the ground and slowly Roll up until you're seated up straight, your body, inhale, exhale, open your arms, clap your hands for yourself because you made it again. I hope to see you tomorrow for day four and please just write the comment below and have a great rest of the day.